<clears throat> okay, we are live and not a minute too late. Um, <laughs> okay, so hello everyone, it's your fair programming guy that just refused to be fixed. Code here. Um, I actually almost <laughs> didn't start the stream up in time. But hey, Spinner, hi, Neon. Stream arrow, uh, damn it. Need to reload page. Well, you do that reloading thing. So, um, quick things first. No, no, Lee, sadly not today. Not today. Um, I... Was, uh, I was, like, on your stream just for a tiny little bit earlier. Um, I guess you discovered Hero, so, um, that is nice. Good to know you found the idiot again. Common Hero Media has been found. Hey, yo. Nice. Uh, anyway, first things first, I have not prepared the playlist today. That will be something I do for next time, because again, something came up today, I was busy for most of the day, so I didn't have time to get everything set up. And if I let it, let the playlist play just through YouTube, then we're gonna have to deal with ads, and I don't want to do that. So, yeah. <laughs> nice for you. Damn, how sad. Uh, I said that the playlist is not set up for today. I didn't prepare it because I was kind of busy today. Um... So, yeah, and if I play it through YouTube, we're gonna have to deal with ads, so we're not gonna do that, because I do want to break from the ads. My streak destroyed because of 50 cents. Like Damn. Did you look at it at least? I had a little bit of a look at it, and the top thing... The very top thing in that list... That seems like such a meme, but thank you, Spinne. I will have to have a listen to that later. Because for right now, I only looked at the list. But there's a lot of Undertale stuff in there. <laughs> which I liked. Um, also, I see a lot, lot of Terraria stuff, but... Eh, again, not too familiar with Terraria, but I'm sure the music is pretty nice. He ordered, I delivered. You know what, that is fair. Very fair. Also, I saw exactly one Danganronpa track in there, interestingly enough. But I'm not complaining. Alright, so, we added, as per request... Biomes are plenty. That does not mean we're going to be exploring the new biomes yet. But it is now added. Some more legendary seed. Not with me, I'm sorry. Ah, uh, 69 videos. Accidentally there were 68, but I added the top. Ah, fair. Very fair. I wouldn't have expected any different from you. <clears throat> Alrighty then. One hour, and as soon as I found here in my stream crash, I got back on and ever. Proof that here is the more okay. Stream crashed. It's like a punch to the face. And a punch from Sock. Ooh. But yeah, come on, you gotta defend the idiot, no matter how much proof there is. He's too dumb to commit a murder, right? So stand up for stand up for your idiot. Protect him no matter the cost. Have faith. Carry into our master mode legendary seed. I mean, I probably would need to be carried. Uh, one person yesterday, because I heard Monokuma's theme. Just had to add it. Uh, that is fair. Monokuma's theme is nice. This tree, however, is not nice. I'm gonna chop this down because I just can't stand to look at this. My best guess, there was a block underneath it, but an enderman took it. And that's why that tree had to float now. I will protect the idiot. And I is the murderer. My stream crap. Hopefully, hopefully you won't run into those problems next time you go live. Hopefully you will actually make it, like, all the way to the trial. At least to the trial, probably, maybe part way into the trial. Depends. <clears throat> Alrighty then. So, as I stated, our plan for today is mainly to keep working on our base. However... As per, as always, we need to get at least one advancement, because that is the goal I kind of set for myself currently, is to get one advancement per stream at least. Um, so, 
since we're going to be doing a lot of building, I should probably figure out what would be best to get today. And I believe... Maybe we should try to get some enduring waste. Now that will mean we have to get back to the end and go back down the uh, radiation hole. However, I don't think I would mind that. I think we should be able to do that. I want to know how to make radium. Let's 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 check our crafting recipes real quick. Where would radium be? There it is. Okay, smelt radiation dust. How do I get the dust? It does not tell me how to get the dust. How do I get radium dust? I mean, it probably has something. It must have something to do um, with the emitting underlilies because they cause radiation. But how I exa how exactly I get the dust, I don't know. That Ifumi didn't die in the nurse's office because he is too fat to be carried. Nothing against him. Yeah, no, you do have a point. He is too fat. How will someone carry this fat fat? Besides Sakura, but she was with us. What? <laughs> um, no. Um, I installed biomes so plenty, but the uh, radiation dust there was a thing that we already had before. Like, we've had that for a while. I want to get adamantite plates. Which means we need to get enduring waste. Hmm. Um, I actually wanted to... You know, Jean-Louis says, this is order very loud. Couldn't find a video. Ah, just add that randomly in the playlist. Perfect. Because why not? Okay, let's see. Wood supply, how are we looking? Spruce, I need slabs. Okay. Oh, let's immediately go back. And I just unlocked a whole bunch of new crafting recipes. Would you look at that? How nice. Okay, first things first. Build slabs. There's no way that's going to be enough. So let's make more. And let's work with these ones for now. So, first up. Um, I'm going to have to be able to... Whoops. Going to have to be able to get back up. Let's just use the wool real quick. And then let's slab it up. Like this. This is your order. Nothing against Ifumi, also me, Hansen, Sex. Hmm. Yeah, totally. Nothing against Ifumi whatsoever. Why would you have anything against Ifumi? <laughs> He's such a nice. Gr He's such a great guy, isn't he? Ha ha ha. There we go. So today we should be able to finish like the entrance hall for the most part. Again, we will definitely decorate the entrance hall a lot more in the future. Um, but that will all come down to, you know, us actually getting stuff to decorate it with. Now, making a painting, that much is easy. That much we can easily do. We could probably also put the dragon egg on a shelf by now. But anything beyond that, we still have to figure out. Just a few paintings and the dragon egg on a shelf. We'll figure out what else to add later. There we go. Light. Lighthearted, and so. 
Yeah, so massively smart. Hmm. Yeah, smart. Totally. Time to jump and survive! It still feels so weird to do that, by the way. Because you know fully well there is no way I should just be taking... that. I should absolutely, absolutely be taking damage from that drop. But I don't. There we go. There he is. Massive. Hmm. Massive. Get it? Ha! Get it because he's fat? No. <laughs> ah, yeah. Hifumi being Hifumi. Well, at least, you know, Hifumi can't be Hifumi any longer. Except in the gacha game. In the gacha game, he's alive again. Because everyone is alive in the gacha game. Because otherwise, how would you get everyone if they weren't alive? I haven't actually gone back to the gacha game in a while, but I remember I was still not able to beat the second to last boss, if I'm not mistaken. Because it is two boss enemies at once, and they both have healing spells. And I am just still not sure how I'm supposed to deal with two boss enemies that have healing spells that are strong enough to heal them back to full HP in a single use. Like, how am I supposed to handle that? I honestly have no clue. Uh, maybe I'll come back and beat it eventually. But right now it's not looking good. Also... It looks like there's passive lighting in here. Unless I'm mistaken, I feel like it should already be a bit darker over here if there wasn't passive lighting. Right? I might not even have to try that hard to light up this entire area. This might actually be relatively easy. Well, that's a surprise. A surprise to be sure, but a welcome one. Also, I realize there's one more thing I want to do. I want to make the edges a little bit nicer, which means... Um, let me go back out real quick. Oh, crap, it's time to sleep again. Don't want phantoms to show up out of nowhere. We got again because she here. I think it was Switch and Steam exclusive, right? Yeah, I think so. I think it's Steam and Switch only. Um, let's see. Dark Oak. Yes. I think Dark Oak is the way to go. Um, also, let's grab a few spare blocks so I can tower up. Um, right. There we go. Make some stairs. And here's what we'll do using those stairs. We will put them up here to round out the corners a little bit more. Yeah, I think that's gonna make it look a little bit nicer. <gasps> the fact that I can do just these stupid jumps with no consequence whatsoever. But man, I really wish I would have thought of doing this before building up the, whole, uh, the entire thing. Because now I gotta do it manually, the stupid way, you know. It's fine though, it's fine. Let's see, how many do I need? 
1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. I made, I made more than I need. Okay, we're good. We're good. We can keep going now. Is the gacha game free? Um, I don't think it is. Well, it was technically... Well, it was bundled with all the other Danganronpa games. Like, if you bu buy the Switch version, Danganronpa Decadence, um, you just get all three killing games and Danganronpa uh, S, which is the gacha game. You get them all bundled together. So technically, it comes it comes for, it comes free with all the other games. Lucky I have a switch. <laughs> Apparently so. By the Danganronpa games, damn. Probably because you already know the plot of everything, and then you know it kind of takes the fun out of it if you already know what's gonna happen. So for season one, I'd have to say Mega Man. <laughs> Just like me. She's allowed to blow up things. Yeah, we everybody likes Megumin. Also, if you like Megumin, here's the good news I have for you. You know that spin-off series I was talking about that Konosuba is getting right now, where episode one already dropped? The spin-off series is Megumin's origin story. Yes. They gave the best character a spin-off series. All is as it should be. <laughs> Come on. Bit more. And there we go. I'll watch them and play them. Get how the games work. Okay, I mean, I guess that's also fair. Know the plot, then you won't have favorite characters. Or you will pick a favorite from the characters that survive. You will just be like, oh, I know these characters survive, and out of them, my favorite is this one. That could also be a thing. And then you don't even try to get attached to the characters you know will, that you know will die anyway. So you're like, huh? So even though some of the characters who die are actually good characters, you don't even give them a shot because you're like, why, why should I bother caring about them if, if they're gonna die? <laughs> yeah, I think that already looks better. She here. She's the best characters. Yes. Spill series or hint that... Series that no one wants to watch. Damn. I am missing one dirt block! There it is. Okay. Um, let's finish up the um, slabs. Let's see here a spin off. Well, again, Chihiro is a playable character in the Gacha game. That is, that is probably as far as it's gonna go with the spin-off. What more do you need? Just kidding. You can always need more. You always need more. Come on. There we go. Almost done. Almost done. <laughs> With the first room of our new home. Just, just, just the first room. The one that's gonna serve absolutely no function other than being a connecting piece. And maybe like a little bit of a, like a showcasing area. Of um, all the stuff we have achieved. Like again, putting the dragon egg in here. I might also frame like um, one of the uh, shards from our first nether star. It really looks like it's just per permanently lit up in this. 
That makes it so much easier. I don't have to worry about lighting this place at all. I don't have to worry about, ooh, how am I going to do the lights? How am I going to do the lights? No, it is just bright in here. It is just permanently bright. Okay. Almost done. Fill out this spot. Really old. I was trying to. It's called a drug. Chocoholics. I mean, you would know a thing or two about being a chocoholic. I know that much for sure. And there we go. That's enough. I made more than necessary, but it's fine. There we go. That is the basic framework of our entrance hall. I think it works. I think this works. It's gonna look nicer once the walls are a little bit more decorated. But for now, this is what we've got. Okay. Next up I'm gonna work on... ...this area real quick. Like that? Yeah, that works! I think, right? Probably. Then I just have to mirror that design on the other side. It is so nice to finally work on a home. It's my that's my name spin off from failed night. I don't know. I don't know what to tell you. Maybe partially because I'm not too familiar with that series? Maybe that's part of the reason why I'm not too sure what to tell you? Okay, now the main thing we need to farm is more wool. So, let's check how our sheep are doing real quick. I don't have much time also. Me who's Christ. I mean, pain would. Wow, really? Scraping toothpicks into. Oh, the fine pain won't dry. What? The... What even? What even? I am not sure how I'm how I'm meant to process that right now. How I'm, how I'm supposed to process that information. Alright. You two breed. And you two also breed. And soon I will force your babies to have babies. For now though, just give me your wool and uh, keep on doing what you're doing. Because I need to go back into our home base. And you know what? I might also start work on the um, decorations for the main hall. Let's get started on some of the decorations. Again, the dragon egg, absolutely a thing that we have to place. Along with... okay, we're gonna need some more stairs. Really wish the cows would shut up. Okay, we're gonna need... Um, as I said, I want to frame... One shard from our first nether star. It just makes sense, you know. 
So I'm gonna need a piece of leather to do that. There we go, there's our frame. Do I have any end rods with me? No, of course I don't, because why would I? In any case, um, right, I can, you know what, might as well also make a painting, because why not? Just one for now, we'll do more in the future. Okay, let's have like our first painting, maybe over here. Maybe over here. Nice. Um, then our first nether star can be maybe framed up there. And let's put the dragon egg. <laughs> maybe over here. Make sure that is a big enough shelf for it. And I will probably put some end rods to the left and right of it later for now. Egg. Just, you know, to uh, have it be a bit more decorated. Yeah, I feel like this could really look nice once we get some more stuff in here. Next up, carpets. Continue working with those. Paint won't dry, so I bought a hundred toothpicks to scrape. Wow. Story. So I don't have to be sad because your favorite character died because I kill all characters before you get a chance to like that one. Wow. But, but why would you do it like that? Why not give people a chance to get to, uh, to like the characters? You know, add that extra element of heartbreak. I think it was like that. One, two, and then at the wall. Yep. Perfect. I believe it was like this. Okay. Slow but sure progress. Soon this place is gonna look real nice. Soon. Very soon. Then the stairs go up here. Make a little bit of a bend around here. Just look at this place already! There is not much, but you can already tell. Just the three extra things I added to the walls already make this whole area feel so much less empty. Right? I think we can all agree. Also, you know what? I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna turn up the volume just a tiny bit more for the game. And you know what? Let's add another item frame. Also, I think, yes, I do think, sometimes, on very rare occasions. Also, I'm gonna sleep. But yeah, I am going to... First of all, I'm going to grab something I've put away so far. And that is the extra pair of iron pants. Sometimes? Yes, sometimes. It didn't work to the first story of my friend. My friend, my friend liked the character really, really so. Decided to make him a character, then my friend decided to never play. We played five months later. Damn! Said you wouldn't, did anyway. That is how it goes sometimes. Alright, I'm gonna take these extra pants. Reason being. When I don't really need the pink panties, I'm gonna put them away, I think. 
Because again, I'm only level 8 right now and I'm not really trying hard to farm experience. So I don't really care about dying. Especially because, you know, I am... Um, mostly... I uh, was well, mostly just um, grinding resources right now and building. So if I die, nothing happens. Which means... When I'm not worried about dying... I'm going to protect the pink panties by putting them away. But I'm going to put them into an easy to reach spot, so nowhere like extremely high up. I'm probably just going to say I'm going to put them... Hmm. You know what? Maybe right next to the door. Or like, right near the door at least. Let's put them right here. There. <clears throat> also, right, I needed to download that uh, thing that Rob added, that uh, resource pack, that, yeah, texture pack for them. In fact, I think I'm gonna uh, put this one maybe somewhere slightly different. Nah, I don't know. I'll leave it there for now. Now nah, I'll put it somewhere different. Maybe somewhere upstairs. Yeah, maybe... Maybe up here. I don't know why, just... I felt like it. Just so the item frames aren't right next to each other. Have to drown your favorite character. But why? Why do you have to do that? Alright, next up, um, on the item gathering thingamajig list. Um, check the sheep again, maybe? I don't know, really, the sheep are the main thing we need right now. It all comes down to getting the wool we, we require. Hi! Right, I can actually take fall damage. Who would have thunked it? You two. You two. Produce more offspring for me. Get to work. Oh, sorry. Hmm. <laughs> Right, also we can't forget, we added more biomes now, so if we do try to go out exploring, we will be able to see new stuff. But I will likely do that either next time or the stream after that. Mainly because, again, work on our home takes priority for now. Alright, here's what I'm gonna do. Put that away. Put the sticks away. Put the stairs away. Equip the shield again. Right. I was out of I was running out of food, wasn't I? I'm totally gonna hang up an ominous banner as well in the entrance hall, I've just now decided. We need at least one ominous banner in our entryway. Absolutely necessary. And you know what, while I'm at it, I could probably also make one more extra painting. First things first, um... Gonna have another look outside. For no reason whatsoever, okay. Uh, another thing, right, right now I remember what else I wanted to do. There it is. Alright. Sorry, but some of you are gonna... You are in the way. Some of you are gonna have to die. Because I require more food. Yeah, that should work for now. Happy Easter, by the way. Right, happy Easter to everyone. You could probably figure it out, but that is part of the reason why I was uh, suddenly busy today and had to postpone the movie night a little bit more. 
But don't worry, that's still a thing that's gonna happen later. We're just gonna have to do it after the stream, as I said already. After the stream, movie night is happening. Alright, put the sword away probably. I don't really have, need to have that on me. And then... We should probably start work on the storage room. Movie night at 3 a.m. Yeah, I know, I know. It's not really for everyone. I know it's not really up everyone's alley. But it works for most people, which is why I'm still gonna do it. Plus, I mean, you only joined in for one of those anyway, so I think it's fine, probably, to just do it like that. Maybe. There we go, ominous banner. We're slowly gonna be filling up this area. Slowly. But once it is done, it's gonna look real nice. Place the carpets while I'm here. Because why not? Nope, not there. Okay, so that's the center done. Nice. And... There we go. Keep watching you. I will turn into a monster or something because the school schedule. I always wake up at 6 to 7 a.m. Even, even at the weekends. Four hours of sleep makes me crazy. Damn. Sucks. But I get that. What movie are you watching? Technically, despite it being a Discord movie night, we're actually watching a series rather than a movie. Um, we're watching the Danganronpa 3 anime series. Currently. Um, we're already like, I think, halfway through at this point. And we're moving on to the next, like, six episodes right now. So, uh, yeah, fun. Fun, fun. Uh, I think we're good to head out, right? I need to figure out what I want to do right now. I could start work on the storage area. Probably should start work on the storage area. Playing after after we're done with Danganronpa, honestly, I'm not sure. Danganronpa is the first time I'm doing a movie night like that. But, um... Honestly, I'd be down with doing more. Um, and I'll have to think about what exactly to do. I was thinking, th there's one idea that I had, which was like do a Liam Vickers movie night. Essentially watching, um, Cliffside... The Intonesian Cube series, the Let's Split Up one shot, and um, all of Murder Drones. Just watching all of Le all of the animations that Liam Vickers ha has worked on. Uh, how about no? <laughs> I love Cliffside, so yeah, we would be rewatching that as well if we did a like Liam Vickers movie night. And yes, I agree, Cliffside is amazing. Really hope that's gonna get turned into a full series at some point. But it isn't looking good right now. Right, you know what I'm gonna do? How does one craft firework rockets? It's about time I look that up. I, I have no clue. All I need is I need paper and I need gunpowder. Well then! <laughs> I guess I was correct. I need paper and I need gunpowder. That's it? That's actually it? Um... Okay, I guess that is actually it. Last minute 11 of murder drones. Ah, well, guess the humor isn't like for everyone really. I mean, I guess I get that. So that would be enough for 30. That would be enough for 60. Which is almost a full stack, so let's say that that's probably enough. 
Um, do I have any paper lying around just randomly, or do, you ha or do I have to make some real quick? I'm gonna have to make some real quick, okay. So. Paper? I guess we'll take one more gunpowder then, just so it's uh, so it adds up nicely. Okay. So I have decided to do something, which is I will actually go back into the end. But if I do that, naturally I will have to take the pink panties because I can't take my elytra with me and worry about chat killing me while doing that. Uh, no sorry, I will not. I will not risk anything. I will not risk the elytra. <laughs> Alright, I will also take... I have a water bucket, which is nice. I will take a pick... X with me the silk touch one or the probably it's it's probably best to take the silk touch one instead of the fortune one They both have unbreaking three. Um, let's use the silk touch one for this Do I know a s P? I don't think so Should I Ooh, almost forgot my boat again. I always forget the boat. So before, we, we will absolutely continue working on everything again later. We will absolutely have to continue work on our base. That is a thing that I want to do. And that is the main focus of the day. But I have decided that we're going to be going to grab some of that totally not ancient debris uh, from the end dimension. And I want to properly use my elytra. So, um, yeah, we're gonna be doing that. The elytra makes travel in the end just so much easier. And again, that way I can easily load a few extra chunks um, before we add the... Um, Oh, the biomes you'll go mod because again all oh, the biomes you'll go does seem to override some stuff when it comes to the end dimension and if I do that right now then I might add all oh, the biomes you'll go next time and then when we go exploring we will have twice as many new, uh, twice as many new biomes to check out as we would now music is fire you need to listen to me as a mix of my fairy tale story. A lot of energy. That sounds like a very odd mix, but I could see how I can see how that would work. Interesting. Intriguing, intriguing, really. Alright, on our way to the stronghold now. Again, pink panties are equipped. There's nothing chat can do to me. I am protected. Ooh, all right, so let's think about the kind of stuff. We still need to build in our base again storage area is our number one priority going forward um, After the storage area probably an enchantment area Well either an enchantment area or like some kind of Like workshop area with like crafting tables furnaces and stuff like that more dogs So yeah, anything that really like, you know, helps us have like a really, uh, like really a mobile base. A bedroom is something I want eventually, just like, you know, living quarters. But the living quarters are not a priority, especially because they're gonna be not too functional. Well, they are gonna be functional, but I'm not gonna be using them out of safety concerns. <laughs> All right. By the way, I might as well. I mean, if I have the shears on me, 
I might as well use them. And yeah, I know what you might be saying. Code, why are you grabbing black wool as well? That's not gonna help you at all. Well, I can still use it to make paintings, okay? I can still use it to make paintings. So I'm gonna grab that. Made a musical story and was split into two parts and a six minute song named to be continued. Just a recap and saying that the story will be continuing. It was the best advertisement for the second part of something I've ever seen or heard. Damn! Well, that is definitely one th uh, one way to do things. That does sound pretty intriguing. Hmm. Oh, that is a cave entrance. So, I guess I'll ask the question right now. What do you think should be our priority when it comes to making, what was it, adamantite tools? Like, obviously, I want to make a full set of armor of adamantite eventually. Just, you know, again, for the advancement. But uh, when it comes to tools, what do you think should be our number one priority? I honestly think a shovel would be so valuable because shovels are like the one tool that you essentially don't really want to make more of because you're like it's a waste of resources and they break just consistently like you break you you break so many shovels when you actually need to grind resources so I feel like having an unbreakable shovel would actually be like one of the more valuable tools to make like Pickaxes, we will have a bunch of different pickaxes with mending and everything. And like with pickaxes with mending, like when you mine ores, you're gonna get experience from the ores, so they fix themselves. A shovel doesn't really benefit from mending as much, because you have to go out of your way to fix it. With a pickaxe, it basically happens like on the go. Like while you're using it normally, you will fix it also again. That is a ruined portal I still need to check out at some point. But now is not the time. Now is not the time. Right now it's stronghold time. Also, I should probably spend a few nights, you know, not sleeping. So I can get some, um, some phantoms to spawn and actually kill them. Because until I put mending on the elytra, and even when I have mending on it, I still have to actually get experience. So it might be beneficial to just, for now, maybe get some phantom membranes. At the very least, I should eventually set up an XP farm. And again, look, uh, look into getting some mending books. Mending books are gonna be very useful to have sooner or later. Now here's the thing, while I'm here, I'm also gonna go ahead and... Actually, no, I should have some saplings in here. No need to chop a tree, I can just grab the saplings. I thought I had saplings in here. I guess I was wrong. But I do have some wool! Nice. Um, okay, I guess we'll chop down this tree before we uh, move on. Humans are stupid. Oh, you said that's low. Why do people okay. created hell? Damn. Okay, that is some deep shit there. Recap of a book. What else I've ever heard? Again, I might have to check it out. I might have to check that stuff out. Because it really sounds like the way you're describing it, and I know at least you're really into it. So it might be worth a quick investigation from me. Shovel, shovel, fixed. Um, let's take extra cobblestone with me as well. The main main reason for that being that um, I'm gonna benefit. I'm gonna benefit from extra building materials, because if I have to go like into the underlily biome 
I'm gonna have to be able to make some ground for myself to walk on, okay? Now, I know there are multiple underlily biomes we have discovered so far. However, I will probably, uh, because, yeah, again, I will still want to, I do still want to spawn more underlily biomes. But, um, I think it would be in our best interest to, um, check out one we're we were already at. For obvious reasons. Time for Daniel Rompa. I just do anything else besides investigate. So, yes, the hero survives. Yes. Look for some kind of. Like, you have to find alibis for him. I know he doesn't have an alibi, but maybe you can find something. You have to. Find anything that points to anyone other than him. And ignore any clues you don't like. Ignore any clues you don't like, just look at whatever points to him not being the culprit. <clears throat> For example, clue number one. He's too dumb to pull off any kind of crime. See? Already cleared of suspicion. Safe. Alright. Radiation hole is that way. I have one, but it can easily be countered. You have to find more then. Have faith in the idiot. You must have faith in the idiot. All right. We're almost there. And by almost there, I mean there's like 300 more blocks to travel, but still. Sleep and woke up in a locker in a robot costume that he apparently has never seen. Hmm, yes. Maybe he just got incredibly drunk and had just like a complete blackout and doesn't remember anything from uh, from what happened before. You don't know. I still believe in the idiot, yes. As you should. Alright, that's a hole, but we're looking for the one we already kind of secured a little bit. This is it. This is the radiation hole that we actually secured. Right? Okay. Go, go, go. Oh, he didn't do a perfect job of securing it, but the radiation isn't increasing. Also, now I get the advancement. Why didn't I get it last time? No, seriously, why did I not get the advancement last time? Yeah, I see one of the blocks that we need. Do you see another one somewhere? There is another one, right? Let's build over to that. Secure the area around it a bit more. Just be aware of all the radiation, you know. Wait. Now I get radium dust! Why didn't I get any radium dust last time I was down here? I thought I also mined that stuff. There is some kind of flying mob down there. I am kind of scared. If that thing is aggressive... I might be in trouble. Alright. Uh, has boy die. If I do good anime. Hi, Rob. Welcome back to the radiation hole. Only has two... E well, that's a short anime. Like two episodes as in it's still airing? And only has two episodes currently? Or... I think it's finished. I am scared of what that is. I don't know what that is. I don't know. 
and I have a feeling it's aggressive. I have a very strong feeling it's aggressive and I am potentially in a lot of danger. No, it only has one, damn. Holidays hard. Leon and Mondo already died. I can't let Yasuhiro, the only character that I still like, die. Yes, protect, protect. So it's an isekai, okay. Rob has found another isekai anime. Sambak is a different human. Huh. Do you see any more of those purple blocks? I see these two. Do you see any others nearby? Because I don't. Ah, wait, there's another one over here. And two more of those strange creatures that I don't know what they are. Okay, so I guess the blocks aren't super rare, which is good. Okay, you know what? I got an advancement, which was the main thing I wanted. We also cleared out some more stuff, so we can easily mine that block next time. And I have some of that stupid radiation dust thingy now. Honestly, was the mod just not working correctly last time I played? Kuromaru. Um, anyway. First Isekai, then again Isekai. Wow. What's high, Phoenix again? So apparently the mod wasn't working correctly last time I was here. Because A, remember, I found another species of um, entity last time I was here that wasn't there the first time I was here. And now I found these creatures, which also weren't here the first time. And the first time I was here, I didn't get the achievement. So I guess the first time I explored, the mod just wasn't working correctly. The creatures didn't spawn, I didn't get the achievement, and I didn't get the extra drops. But now everything seems to be working. Uh, what was added? Biomes or plenty? Although we haven't gone to any of the new biomes yet. Okay, here's now here's what I want to do. I want to generate a few more structures. I just want, uh, or not structures, I want to generate a few more of the biomes before we, um, you know, before we install, um, what was it? Oh, the biomes you'll go. Because oh, the biomes you'll go again overrides the biome generation in the future. I, I am doing well. I am doing very well. Summon to another world for a second time. Right, might have to check that one out too. So yeah, biomes or plenty was added today. Which we will check later. Alright. I am ready for my first Elytra flight in this world. Kind of scared. But we'll do what has to be done. So I have to fly in this direction. It's working! Thanks, Rob. I have to look at that later. Thanks for pointing it out to me. I will totally have a look. Ouch. Alright, I think I found the border. Do I have enough momentum? Oh, that's close, but I have enough. Haha, <laughs> just barely enough momentum to make it up. Okay. Uh, first things first, check durability. Alright, durability is looking good. We can easily keep doing this. I am not really familiar with Elytra durability. Because anytime I have used it, I had the benefit of, like, having mending on it because someone sold it to me on, on a server. Little migraine, but that's, ooh, still. Migraines still suck. Hope it gets better soon. Man, I like this biome, by the way. I think this biome looks really nice. The particles too. Like I could totally build a base here. But I'm not going to. Instead, I'm gonna see what's up here. Wait, where did the radia- do I still have the radiation? Why is it not going away? Why is the radiation not going away? Odd. Ooh, terrain generate- oh, okay! That firework rocket triggered way later than I actually used it. Okay, there's another one of those underlily biomes, which is nice. 
So we're dealing with a little bit of lag apparently for biome generation or for terrain generation in, uh, in total. Whoops. I think I accidentally looked at some of them. Not good. Hey look, an end city and a um, gateway portal. Let's fly over here real quick. I don't think the endermen are chasing me still. I hope. Yeah, okay, I think I'm good. They were just moving so quickly, I think I might have accidentally looked at them for a second. Alright. Let's have a look over here. Man, the new terrain generation is going crazy. Um, something in your general. Yeah, I will have to check that. Now I... My eyes made him look so bad. Damn. Damn. Sucks. Alright. Totally gave us sus. I am familiar that Rob can uh, quote people in very interesting ways. And I know that Deadly Gamer has been affected by Rob quoting at this point as well. <laughs> okay, this is an end city with a ship, which is nice. Um, let me quickly make this a waypoint. And city... I'm just gonna, you know what, I am at this point, I should just stop putting numbers there. I'm just gonna get confused. Oh, his eyes. Ah. Okay. Poor thing in general. Okay, I'll have a look. Later. Go in. Instant health. Why, thank you. Put this on real quick. Oh, hello. Come on, open up. Thank you. What do we have? Mending and efficiency, that is really nice. Curse of vanishing, protection. Curse of binding, protection. Curse of... Curse of Binding Diamond Pants, I'm never gonna wear- Ooh, these ones are really good. Let's see. You know, I really should have grabbed my, um... My Ender Chest, if we're being real. Really should have taken that one with me, huh? But you know what, it's fine. I guess I'll ditch the vines for now. I wanted two end rods, but I have only found one. Fire protection as soon as I, like, can. We have to farm experience for that and stuff. I'll totally do that later. And with later, I mean at some point, but at some point that isn't right now. Alright, grab that. Damn it. Uh, I mean, grab that one. Okay, um... Nice. Dragon head obtained. That's another good thing to add to my walls. Alright. Do you think we've... Generated enough of the biomes now? I think so. Uh, or should we take one more little flight? Gosh, there's one in the, in an end city? Uh, mm, I don't know. I don't know. Dragon head on and fly. Put the dragon head on and fly? Fine.
I'm flying with the dragon hat because you want me to. We'll generate a few more chunks and then we'll slowly start heading back, okay? Whoa! Ho, ho, ho! This looks so cool! Yo! Ow! Man! Oh my god, these biomes! Fine, there. There was your little F5 thing. Hope you're happy, Rob. Whoa, what is this? Whoops. Fire? Oh my god, that delay! That delay scared me! That is interesting. Huh. I'm down here right now. Hmm. You know what, let's grab some glowstone while I'm here because I need, I kind of need some glowstone. And then I'm gonna um, probably head back, I think. Yeah. Doing something. All right, BRB. See you. See you then, Rob. See you whenever you decide to return. All oh, right, I need to throw something out again. Um, you know what? <sighs> that one piece of black wool is really unnecessary. Let's face it. Okay, that should be enough glowstone. So if I fly straight back, then I should be able to clear out this area in the middle that's currently kind of empty. Elytra durability is still looking really good. In that case... Let's go. And just look at the new end dimension. It looks so nice. Okay, the return gateway is this way. It should be a relatively straight shot from here. And Elytra of Light makes Elytra of Light make the, makes this so nice. So easy to explore everything. Whoops. To the gateway, to the gateway. Ha! And that's how you escape angry endermen. You just fly into a gateway and you're safe. Again, because the pain needs to dry. Ah, I see, I see. All right. Also, hello, Ivanov. Welcome. How are you? All right, let's switch back to our helmet real quick. Switch back to the chest plate. 
Okay. So. We did one of the things we wanted to do. Let's do this. There we go. Um, go back to the portal one more time so we actually go back to spawn. I don't know why I set my respawn point over here. Kind of a dumb thing to do. But now I have a little bit more of an understanding of the durability of these elytras. That took about half of the durability. Now we have a second one, which is totally fine. But we really should start getting some mending on them if we can. Which means we have to either enchant them directly... Or, again, um... Or try to get mending on a book. Either from the enchantment table or from a villager. So maybe, maybe we should go to a village. To get a librarian, we need a lectern, right? Lecterns should be fairly easy to either make or... Technically, I could have grabbed one from the stronghold now that I think about it. Ah, it's fine. Our main priority right now... ...is building anyway. That's the main point of the stream. Pretty good. The Owl House finale. Lifted my spirits. Nice. Is this a good time to say that I don't actually watch the Owl House, but I know it's really good and I've been feeling like I probably should watch it, but for some reason I still haven't watched it. And I don't know why. Also, didn't I have a sec an another Shulker shell somewhere? Did I not take it with me? Well, that's stupid. <clears throat> Alright. So we have made our advancement for the day, which is really nice. Potions! Hello! Get in there. Some iron. Some gold. We can put the boat away. Also the cobblestone. You know what? The elytra should probably go in here. Why did, even, why did I even take some of the stuff with me? Um, put the second elytra away as well. Along with the firework rockets. No reason for me to have that stuff on me. Right. Honestly, I'm probably going to combine these two. Right, I can't put it. Uh, I can't get it from an iron pickaxe onto the diamond one. Right. But if I did this, yeah, that doesn't work. I can only do it like this. And it would upgrade it to efficiency five, which is really nice. But I need one more level to pull that off. Should be relatively easy to get one more level. So uh, we'll do just that. Put the glowstone in here. Don't really have space for a boat. Actually, I do. Why do I have two bows like this? Just combine them, idiot. Did you see that Among Us image posted after the last stream? Yes. Looking clean, I have to say. That dude is wearing full enchanted golden armor. Can you get away from the door, please? Okay. You're gonna have to perish. I don't know what makes you so special that you deserve a full set of enchanted golden armor. I don't even know what enchants are on this shit. Okay, but now I can do the thing. While I combine these two pickaxes. Actually, I feel like I might even want to... No, no. Let's just do the combination thing right now. Because I am about to do something that will put me at risk. Silk Touch and Mending and Efficiency 5. Boom. So, the thing that I'm about to do which will put me at risk... There. I know Rob is doing other stuff right now and is, you know, BRB and all that. But, still. There's an... I can't risk doing it too much. I mean, yeah, again, as I said, I 
don't really care about losing levels, especially right now, because I don't have any levels. Alright. So, um, I don't have anything to lose, which is why I don't want to risk damaging the pink panties right now pointlessly. So they're gonna go there. Um... Some end rods over here to liven things up a bit more. Then I am going to put the dragon head somewhere. Hmm. It has been a while. How have you been? Hope you've been well. Hope you have been well. What have you been up to? A whole bunch of stuff, I assume. Um, sure, you know what, let's put that up here. Uh, actually, I don't, I don't know if that looks that great up there. Not been up too much? Ah, but at least you've been well, that's what matters. That is what matters. Welcome back. Welcome back. Uh... Has to be somewhere a little bit higher up, I would say. You know what? Maybe let's just put it right here. I like how I'm just putting everything on this wall currently. <laughs> but yeah, this will slowly start to get filled out. Nice. But yeah, welcome back. Um... We've done a bunch of stuff on this uh, uh, since you were last here. Honestly, it's been so long. I don't even remember when you were last here. But uh, yeah, we have started playing Minecraft again, which is it's been a long time since I uh, since I streamed this game. Um, but yeah, we picked up this little series of adding a new mod every time I stream. It's been nice so far. Yeah, it was probably some FNF stream. That seems likely. It does seem likely. Yeah, this is starting to look more and more like a proper home. Okay. So soon we will... Ha I think it is about time we get to... S uh, we start working on the storage. How are our furnaces doing? Okay, they have been working away. Because I think stone bricks work best in a storage facility, maybe. I'm really leaning to using stone bricks. As well as maybe some stripped logs. So, it's the new mod. It was seven months ago? Damn, and what do you mean until recently? So you so you just worked on another mod that released? Nice. Nice, nice. What kind of mod was it? I am kind of curious. Um, now let's grab that stuff and hmm. have like two hours just to realize that I'll be too bloody, messed up, blood, painting, just to put my, it's good, good for my level, it's useless. I don't know how to look some epic looking blood effect. Okay, that's still, th still something. I released another mod, a one shot, FNF obviously, yeah. I had a feeling it was FNF. Four. Make two blocks. Like this. Oh, wait. There's the dimensional dust. Then I'm gonna need two of my. Why did I put that down here? I need two of my diamonds. To do this. Okay, what else do I need for the dimensional thingy? Um, there we go. Glowstone and blocks of dimensional material. Eight of them. Okay. That is fair. I can do that much. Three. Like that. Okay. 
Now let's build the last two dimensional focus thingies. So we have that taken care of. Uh, about Portal Flash. Interesting, because I was bored. Nobody I showed it to knew what Portal Flash was. Please tell me you know what Portal Flash is. I've heard I've, I've heard of it. I've heard of it, but I never played it. And I don't I haven't really seen much of it either. But I have heard of it at least. I hope that is better than the stuff you've encountered so far. It says it's at least something, right? Probably. But man, I I know it's gotta feel bad when you when you're really passionate about some when you're passionate about something and want to make a mod of it, and few few people have heard of it. Yeah, when you want to make a mod of something and then you realize that nobody has heard of it. That sucks. That really does suck. All right. Hmm. Nobody I know has played it. Ah, uh, uh, that's... Uh, mm. I kind of know your pain, but not like when it comes to that game specifically, but still. Not on PC. So fun because of mods. Xbox, I have Minecraft Marketplace where I can play it when... Oh, mod. Get three new weapons! Yay! Yeah, the PC v version is much better. This is this is uh, where you get peak Minecraft in the Java edition. Let's go in. All right, first things first. Finally, fill out that hole in the middle. It's been bothering me for so long. Okay, next up, this is going to be where our storage is going to go. Um, let's first place the carpet we have. Ah, not quite there yet, but that's fine. At least we're making progress. That was great, and one of the developers on Portal Flash kind of in a way made Portal 2 still Portal themed. How whole whole as YouTube documentary on how impactful for Portal Portal Flash was. I'm gonna have to look into that. I think. Want to talk to friends in school about taking a but no one knows it from the people I know. So I was like that. Damn it! Of course, no one knows it. Just, just some weep thing. Why would anyone care about it? Okay, so this. Over here is where I'm gonna build the storage. 